Yo guys, how is it going? I hope everyone is having a fantastic day. Welcome to episode 13 of our Lazio career mode here on FIFA 20. In today's episode, we start with our final group game in the Europa League against Stad Rene. And then three days later, we have Calori away from home in Serie A. And I believe they have had a very good start to the season. I think they're in fifth place. Let's take a quick look. Yes, they are in fifth place. Nine wins, three draws and three losses, picking up 30 points. So that could turn out to be a pretty tough game. But before we get into that game, we have our final group game in the Europa League away at Stade Rene. So let's go to France and end the group stage on a high with a win. on the ball for the home team and it's going to be a throw into Stad Rene Cresswell with it into De Silva for De Grenier Tay on this left hand side up against Patrick he gets past me but Patrick is trying to keep up a cross in and the young centre back what a defensive header that was can we go up the other end and open the scoring Cataldi it's a very good attempt out to Adekanye and what a first touch that is from the youngster short into Andre Anderson now Casado, it's a decent turn onto his right foot from the striker. And the first chance away at goal comes for us. But unfortunately, it's a simple save for the goalkeeper. But a very good start to the game from both sides. Bastos on this left-hand side into Andre Anderson. It's a good turn onto his right foot. And here the youngster goes. He's gone past one. Can he go past two? He's still going. What a run here from Andre Anderson. And the shot goes comfortably over the crossbar. But what a run from the youngster. But unfortunately, the strike towards goal wasn't great. And the score remains at nil-nil. But 13 minutes gone, we've already had two chances away at goal. So hopefully, more to come and the first goal. Bastos for to Cataldi. It's a decent turn around the Stad Rene man. And here the midfielder goes. Who's going to make me a good forward run? Left-hand side, I see Adekanye. And it's a good turn onto his right foot here. The youngster goes short into Andre Anderson. First time finish on his left foot into the bottom corner. 17 minutes gone. Stad Rene nil. Lazio 1. What a start to this match. Rafinha on the ball. Plays it forward to Niang. Lovely 1-2 between the two strikers. And Niang's got loads of space ahead of him on his left foot. And thankfully it's a comfortable save for the goalkeeper. And that is Stad Rene's first chance away at goal. And thankfully, the score remains 1-0 to us. Bastos on the ball. Short into Cataldi. Out to that right-hand side in Marusic. And it's a very good pass. What can we do here with Marusic? Oh, he's completely done the defender. Here we go. Marusic is still going. Can we find a Lazio man? Yes, we can. A similar sort of goal. But this time from the right-hand side, Marusic with a very good run past the defender and just passes it into Casado and it's a very simple finish once again Stad Rene nil Lazio 2 we have been absolutely fantastic in this match so far and we are 2-0 up after 40 35 39 minutes Casado with his second Europa League goal of the season Traore on this right-hand side for Stad Rene. Whips and across. It does get blocked and it stayed in. Okay, we've kept possession here. Adekanye has done very well. Andre Anderson forward to Bastos. Decent first touch. Now Cataldi. This is decent play. Can we grab the third goal and completely bury this game? Casado to his left-hand side. I see Andre Anderson and it's a decent pass. But the centre-back is just too strong for the youngster and they break up the attack. 10 minutes into the second half and so far nothing has happened in this second 45 minutes Grenier out to this right hand side in Traore oh it's a very good cross Niang with the header but thankfully he's offside and the score remains 2-0 what a cross and it was a very good headed finish from the striker but thankfully the offside flag goes up and yes he's just offside 57 minutes gone and thankfully the score remains Stad Rene nil, Lazio 2. 
Cataldi on the ball, forward to Andre Anderson. Now Casado, left hand side is Adekanye, and it's a very good pass as well. Brilliant turn here from Adekanye with the shot. And it does get blocked and they get the ball away. But hopefully we are going to keep possession here. And we do. It's a lovely header into Cataldi. Now Andre Anderson into Adekanye. Decent first touch. Bullet of a strike from the youngster. But what a save from the goalkeeper. 62 minutes gone. And I think we are going to make a sub or two. Who do we have on the bench? I think we're going to bring Johnny on for Marusic on that right hand side and Andre Anderson off for Luis Alberto from the corner we go Cataldi whips it in it's a good delivery it's going to fall nicely to Luis Alberto off the line by the centre back that was going to hit the back of the net for 3-0 and completely game over but what a clearance off the line Patrick on the ball, forward to Casado. It's a decent first touch as well. Now Luis Alberto back into Casado, and it's a fantastic pass. Casado is still going. Surely it has to be a penalty. Come on, ref. That has to be a penalty. Did you see the pass from Luis Alberto? That was absolutely insane. Look at this. Look. Jesus. Pure strength there from Casado. And is it a penalty? I mean, he's pushed me in the back. He sees hands go into my back. And Casado gets taken out. Oh, we've won possession back. Luis Alberto, Parolo into Adekanye. Decent turn onto his left foot. Back onto his left foot again. Adekanye, high and wide. 15 minutes left to play. And that was a very good chance. I could have even played it short. Look, for a tap in to Luis Alberto, I think that is. Oh, that should be 3-0 and game over. Parolo on the ball, forward to Casado, and it's a decent turn. To his left-hand side is Luis Alberto, and it's a very good run. Luis Alberto, brilliant save, open goal for Casado, and he finishes it off really, really well. 12 minutes left to play, 3-0, three points. Rafinha on the ball, into Grenier, surrounded by Lazio players, and somehow he's still in possession, gets a strike away towards goal, but thankfully... It was a comfortable save for the goalkeeper, but it was heading towards that top corner for 3-1. But with six minutes of the 90 left to play, I don't think there's any chance Stad Rene are getting back into this game. But here Patrick comes down this right-hand side. Can we make it 4-0 across into Casado With the header looking for his hat-trick. But unfortunately it goes high over the crossbar and the score remains 3-0. For Casado. that's a very good chance. But that's a poor finish. Four minutes of the 90 left to play. And like I said, I don't think there's any chance of the home side getting back into this game. So we've ended the group stage on a high with a very good win over the French side. It was such a good performance and could have easily been a few more goals. And also, we did not concede a goal in the group, which is absolutely brilliant. So hopefully... That's a sign of things to come in the knockout stages and we can go on a good run in the Europa League. The full-time result here in France is Stade Rene 0, Lazio 3. on this left hand side into Immobile dodgy pass into Lucas but we do keep possession Lucas once again for to Correa now Immobile this is very good play can we go up the other end and open the scoring with our first attack into Correa onto his left foot keepers coming up against Correa and the keeper gets there first very good goalkeeping from Olsen nine minutes gone and it's been an okay start from both sides to be honest so hopefully more to come and we can grab the opening goal of the game. Emerson on this right-hand side across into the far post. Oh, is it going to find a Lazio man? Yes, it does. Off both posts. Are you kidding me? Oh, my God. Immobile with the effort towards goal. That was a shot, by the way. It wasn't a cross. I was actually going for the scissor kick. I was holding L2. 
hits it back into the box and Lazari smashes it towards goal hits the far post rolls along the line and then hits the other post and falls into the arms of the goalkeeper I mean oh god that is ridiculous Pellegrini on this left hand side it's a brilliant first touch from the full back whips and across and thankfully we do get the ball away and it's going to fall nicely to a Lazio man Lukaku Correa into a Mobile. oh it's a dodgy first touch but we do keep possession right Lukaku on this left hand side forward to Correa now Immobile this is very good play oh beautiful first touch from the striker surely for 1-0 Immobile what a finish Olsen no chance 20 minutes gone and we have opened the scoring what a finish from the striker absolutely lashed it into the top corner I want to see a replay oh it's a perfect angle as well that first touch was just brilliant and look at that finish. Calgary nil. Lazio 1. Pellegrini on this left hand side. It's a charging run from the full back. And the forward pass finds Emerson. Now Radu into a Cherby. Left hand side is Lukaku. Short into Milinkovic Savic. Correa. Milinkovic Savic once again. Correa. Right hand side is Lazari. Is it over here? Yes. That was nearly brilliant play. But unfortunately, the final pass out to Lazari on that right-hand side is way over hit. 25 minutes gone, and I really want to grab a second goal. I think that would kill the game off quite a bit, to be honest. But yeah, since we've opened the scoring, nothing has really happened, and Calgary haven't been in the game whatsoever. We have been the much better team, so like I said, hopefully more to come, and we can grab the second goal. Lukaku with the throw-in into Milinkovic Savic. Now Correa. Lucas, Lazari and it's a great first touch to keep possession out to Emerson on this right hand side across into the far post and what a delivery off the woodwork once again what a volley from Milinkovic Savic that should be 2-0 Simeone on this right hand side plays it backwards to Cacciatore now Pereiro backwards to Nandez this is a good spell of possession for the home team into Nangolan back into the striker what a save what a save down low to his right hand side to keep us in the lead brilliant link up play between the striker and midfielder and it's a decent first time strike as well going towards that bottom corner for 1-1 but a brilliant save corner kick incoming they play it short into Nandez oh it's a brilliant turn onto his left foot is he going to whip and across? He plays it short into a teammate. Is it going to find the striker? Yes, it does. And I've played it straight into Pereira. Nandez with the attempt towards goal. And what an attempt it is. Curls it into the top corner. 1-1. Game back on after 38 minutes. Wow. What a finish from the midfielder. That was totally my fault. Here, I should have cleared it away, but I've played it straight into Pereiro. I think it was. He lays it off to Nandez, and look at this finish. Perfect angle as well. Right in the top corner. 1-1, one, one, game back on. Johnny on the ball. It's very good play to go past one. Plays it into a Mobley, but Nandez, the goal scorer, with the interception. Cacciatore into Nandez forward to Holoshi who really hasn't seen possession whatsoever and the first time he really does he gives it away now Lazari into Correa Immobile out to Johnny on this left hand side can we find a Lazio man Johnny is still going what a run here from Johnny he's into the box on his left foot Johnny with the attempt towards goal and it's a very good save from Olsen at his near post minutes left to play in this first half can we retake the lead a header towards goal from Milinkovic Savic but it goes over the crossbar and out for a goal kick wow if that went in that would have been an unbelievable headed goal but unfortunately goal kick and the score remains 1-1 Nangolan on the ball forward to Pellegrini on this left hand side back into the midfielder and it's a great interception from the fullback. And what a pass out to Johnny on this left hand side. Seconds left to play in this first half. Can we retake the lead? Johnny is still going. It's a fantastic run. Johnny with the attempt towards goal. 
and it's a decent block maybe I should have passed it <laughs> but the half time whistle has gone and it's 1-1 at the break but the first goal in this game had brought it to life so hopefully more of the same in the second 45 minutes and more goals Johnny on the ball decent play to turn inside now Immobile to his right hand side is Correa Immobile once again brilliant first touch from the striker and once again he lashes it past Olsen for us to retake the lead Calorie 1 Lazio 2 what a start to the second 45 minutes first attack in the second half and it results in the third goal in this game Brilliant link-up play between Correa and Immobile. Brilliant first touch. And what a finish once again. 2-1. We've retaken the lead. Lazari on this right-hand side. Overlap from Emerson. Can we go up the other end and wrap up this game? Emerson is still going. What a run. Can we find Lazari? No, we can't. It's just behind Immobile. Now Malinkovic-Savic. Short back into the striker. Gets deflected off the woodwork once again. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. 57 minutes gone and somehow it's hit the woodwork after being deflected off a calorie player. And the score remains 2-1. Immobile on this right hand side into Emerson. Now Milinkovic Savic and it's a very good pass as well but Nandez is just too strong for the midfielder. Pellegrini with a ball over the top and it's a great first touch as well from the calorie man of decent forward pass into the striker and what a finish into the bottom corner once again it's game back on 63 minutes gone it's 2-2 what a game this has been so far and there's still half hour left to play it's a brilliant forward pass and what a finish on the volley while the ball is coming from behind him that is an absolutely fantastic finish. Correa on the ball into Milinkovic Savic. Left hand side is Johnny. Can we grab our third goal in this game? A very good pass into Correa off the woodwork once again. Oh, I give up. I give up. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. 68 minutes gone. And I'm going to make some changes. Right, we're going to bring Andre Anderson on for Correa. And Johnny off. Actually, do you know what? No, Lazari off on that right-hand side for Marusic. Throwing on this right-hand side. Simeone with it. Into the centre-back, Oliver. Into Simeone once again. And it's a very good tackle from Johnny. Short into Lukaku. That's a very good forward pass into Milinkovic Savic. Now Lucas, we've lost possession, but somehow we've kept it. Immobile to his right hand side is Andre Anderson. Surely for us to retake the lead. Andre Anderson into the bottom corner, and we do retake the lead. For the third time in this game, we've taken the lead. Unbelievable. What a game this has been. Andre Anderson coming off the bench and potentially grabbing the winning goal. Calorie 2, Lazio 3, with just over 5 minutes of the 90 left to play. Olivar on the ball for the home side. It's a charging run. And apparently, that's a free kick. We've played 3.5 minutes of injury time. 3 were added on. If they score from this free kick, I'm going to be so, so mad. 26 yards out. Clark with the attempt. And it's a fantastic save. I think he hit the post as well. It's a brilliant attempt from the defender. It's a save. My controller vibrated like it hit the post. That's why I thought it hit the post, but I don't think it did. Mangolan whips in the cross. It's a good one, but Milinkovic Savic gets it away. And referee blow the full time whistle. And there it is. Five and a half minutes of injury time was played. Three were added on. Absolutely ridiculous. But the most important thing is. We've picked up the three points. What a game this was. 1-0 to us. 1-1. 2-1 to us. 2-2. And then with five minutes, well, six minutes left to play of the 90, Andre Anderson grabs the winning goal. And the full-time result is Calorie 2, Lazio 3. What a roller coaster of a game. 
So after a fighting win away at Calgary, we have moved up to 8th place. Now on 26 points. And my main aim in the league now is to finish in 5th. We are still 12 points away from 4th place. And that was my main aim at the start of the season. A top 4 finish. But after a poor start, the opening 9 games is what completely ruined the season. 5 wins and 4 draws. It was so up and down not picking up points on a regular basis. So my main aim now is to finish in fifth place and we sit four points behind Cowdery. Next episode, we have two Serie A games at home to Verona and then away at Brescia who are our first game of 2020. So let's wrap up today's episode by doing some training. I don't think there's going to be any growth, is there? No. So that's going to wrap up today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have an amazing day. Peace.